What is up everybody? My name is Grimmer Free. Welcome back to a brand new episode of Redstone Craft. Today, ladies and gentlemen, we're back here on Redstone Craft. And last episode, we built the beautiful centerpiece right there. Uh, and we have now finished our circle, um, which is obviously the main part of our base. It has our sorter, our smelter, and all that. But we're not done with building stuff around here. And today, we're going to build something else. Now, you might have seen it by the title, but... What we're going to be building today is an episode counter. Now, uh, you might be wondering, well, that's a bit useless. And you're right, it is. It's purely cosmetic. I just really wanted to have one. Uh, I think it gives, I don't know, a little personality to this. And I can count how many episodes we're on. Because right now, we're on episode 87. Which is incredible, by the way. Um, it's been over a year since we started this. Actually, it's been almost two years since we started this. So... I'm excited about this, and there's going to be a bunch of cool stuff coming after, but I thought we should make this little episode counter. So, with that, began my search for a good counter online that I could just pop into here, and I found one by Meizuma Games. I know, the man does so much stuff. Um, but yeah, today we're going to be building Meizuma Games counter, and in order to get started, we need to pop it into his creative world to check out the counters that he has, because he has a bunch of them. So... We're going to pop into that right now. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, so we're here in his creative world, and I should point out immediately that uh, I will leave a link to his video down in the description below. If you guys want to go check it out, you definitely should. So let's start over here. So this were his old counters. Now, I actually don't know if these are working anymore. Um, I didn't really test these. Yeah, I don't think these are working. Uh, this was pre-1.16, so it's a bit broken nowadays. Um, you can see that he has a bunch of them. And then there are these. Now, these are the counters that are, we care about. So this is uh, 0 to F hex, which is actually quite an interesting thing. Uh, I didn't actually check this out. I don't know how you plug this in. It's like this. Nope. Okay. Well, regardless, this isn't really what we care about. I have to turn that on. Oh, there you go. Yeah, so... Yeah, so you just... I assume that's two, three, four, right? Yep, so you just do that. And then you have zero to nine SS V-tile. I have no idea what that means. Um, so I assume this is going to be nine, right? Oops, is this off somewhere? Yeah, it was off right here. Yep. Uh, then you have a zero SS binary. That's interesting. Um, okay, so what does this do? Nothing. I'm exploring. Oh, right. This is locked. Sorry, guys. Let's unlock this. And hopefully that's turned on. No, it's not. Hmm, why? I wonder why. Let's try turning all of these on. That work? Okay, so this one doesn't work. Then you have this one. Now, I quite like this one because it's just a page flipping one. So if I flip to page 7, there you go, 7. And this is quite nice because, you know, it's pretty useful. You can just flip the pages up and down. And I even has an off, which is cool. Uh, and I actually thought about using this because this is a really cool idea. Um, obviously, he tiled these. You don't actually need to tile these, uh, but you can. Then there's this one. And I don't really understand how you turn this one on and off, to be honest. I might be this button. But, yeah, I, I'm not really sure how this one works. If I am being honest, that work? Yep, that increased to 7. Um, what's that gonna do? That turned it off. So, you know, this is a bit confusing. Uh, and then he has specific ones. So this one is a counter up and carry. Uh, so if you hit this, this is, should go to zero. And if there was another one of these to the side, it would carry. And then again, and one, two, 
free. There you go. And then there's this one, which is down and carry. And I guess this is in the wrong place. Yeah, six, five, four, three. Okay. Uh, counter up and down, no carry. I assume one of these is up. I forget which one's up. That's nine. That's zero, so I guess this is up. Uh, so let's try this again. This should go to one, right? Hmm, there break. Might have broken it. Nine. Then. Oh, right, this is the one that goes up. Right, and might not be able to go up here. Um, eight, there you go. And then this should be... Nine, yep, and these in the middle are reset, so this resets to nine, this resets to zero. Um, and then he has this one, which I found quite amusing, which is, it's an actual clock, and I think it's the blue that goes up. I hope it's the blue that goes up. No, the blue goes down. Okay. Um, actually, I think the blue resets, but, you know. If I do this, right, and we go up a couple of seconds, two, three... Four and then five. Okay, and then this is supposed to go to six, but right now you have a minute and 62 seconds, which is just two minutes and two seconds. So if I press this, you're gonna see that it goes to zero and this goes to two. So this is an actual functioning clock. If you put an input to this one right here, every millisecond or every second, whichever one you want, you could use this as a proper clock, which is quite nice. And we might come back to use this at some point. Uh, but what we really want is this one, up and carry. Now, originally, you can see these right here were put in by me. Uh, originally, I tried copying that over there to here, and it sort of didn't work that well. Um, I don't remember why, but I think this one over here didn't work. So I, I'm not sure why, so I just sort of quit on it. Um, and then I decided, you know what? All we need is up and carry. And I copy pasted the up and carry here. Now, for some reason in my tests, like if I pull this up to nine, seven, eight, nine, if I hit it again, it doesn't carry. And I wonder why, like I tried looking at this, this is all connected, uh, this all makes sense. So I'm not really sure why this isn't carrying. Did I miss something here at the bottom? I don't think I did, this is empty. So I really don't know why this could be happening. Um, could it be the thing in the back? No. Actually, let me try that because I didn't try that. Um, So this locks it, right? Yeah, this turns it off, which is not what I want. Although I guess I can leave it there. I'm not really sure why the carry is not working, um, but honestly, it doesn't matter that much because when we move, like I can just move this one, like four, five, six. I don't know how fast this is actually. Seven, and I actually prefer it this way. This way, if we make a mistake, I can easily just undo the mistake without having to like, go to 999 and then come back. Um, so honestly, this is a pretty good design. It's really compact, you can see right here. Uh, and they're tileable, by the way. So if we ever reach a thousand episodes, I can put another counter here and we can go to a thousand. For now though, I think 999 episodes is enough. <laughs> we maybe, who knows what we'll be doing in 900. Uh, <laughs> And nine hundred and twelve episodes, I think. Um, from now, I don't even know. Nine hundred and twelve weeks from now is a very long time from now. Anyway, point is, this is our segment seven segment display. These aren't actually called seven segment displays. I don't know why. Um, 
but they are, and I sort of just accept that. Um, anyway, I'm not going to be making a tutorial out of this. I'm going to link his video in the description if you guys want to know how to build this. Uh, and he also has the world download if you want to come and fidget with it. All I did was copy paste that one right there. Oops. That one right there three times here and it worked. Uh, and yeah. I guess that's pretty much it. Um, I would try to figure out why the carry isn't working, but honestly, I can't be bothered right now. So, yeah. Oh, and I, there is this button here, which I think resets if I hit it. Right? Yeah, it does. Okay. So, we do have a reset in case we need to. But yeah, with that, ladies and gentlemen, it's time to get to the time lapse and actually build this on Redstone Craft. So, let's get going. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, so we're done. Um, the counter works. It's not doing the carry still, but I don't really mind. I might be missing something uh, somewhere for the carry, but honestly, it doesn't really matter that much. I'm happy with it. Uh, and of course, we should put this in episode 87. So, uh, it's 5, 6, 7, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. The counter is actually not that fast, I guess. Three, eight, four, five, six, seven, eight. There you go. Episode eighty-seven. But as you might be might be guessing, we're not done. Especially because I don't want to leave this like this. This is asking for a creeper to blow up or something to happen, uh, and redstone to be destroyed. 
So now we get to the decorating and I got a little bit of a decoration planned. So we're going to pop into today's second time lapse and make this actually look a tiny bit presentable, shall we? Okay, ladies and gentlemen, we're finally done. Um, <clears throat> I'm actually quite happy about this decoration. I think it looks good. Um, the stone looks a bit iffy, but it actually contrasts pretty well with the netherite. I haven't done a flyby though. <clears throat> it's gonna look better once we decorate like with trees, etc. but that's not our objective for today. I also made this little hill down back here just cause I wanted some uh, like terrain etc you can actually see this is already on an elevated ground i also put the free note blocks over here so i just ran observers from where they were uh and yeah as for the back i installed uh some levers here these shut off each of the designs and if i want to reset them uh i can just break in these two blocks and go down there um not gonna do that right now, but I don't expect me to have to do that that much, but just in case I can. And yeah, this looks great. I'm actually really happy with this. And it now numbers 87, as it should. However, though, that is the end of today's episode. I sincerely hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, make sure to hit that like button, subscribe to your channel. That's all for today, folks. I'm out. Peace.